everyone, my name is Chanel and today I'll be speaking on the COVID-19 vaccine, specifically the BNT162B2 vaccine manufactured by Pfizer and BioNTech. I chose this vaccine although there are many different types of vaccines because all vaccines work slightly differently. Today I'll be addressing these subtopics. Today, the Pfizer BioNTech vaccine has an efficacy of over 92%. The trials regarding the Pfizer and BioNTech vaccine have taken place in three parts and are individually randomized and is placebo controlled. Traditionally, vaccines are weakened or inactivated pathogens that are introduced to the human body, triggering antibody production. However, mRNA vaccines do not work this way. The COVID-19 mRNA vaccine introduces a set of instructions for our cells to produce a certain protein named the spike protein, which is also found on the surface of the COVID-19 virus. Once the spike protein is made, our body recognizes it as foreign and starts producing antibodies specific to it. The same thing is also happening to people who have been infected by COVID-19 and haven't had the vaccination. The Pfizer and BioNTech vaccine works in two doses. Let us address the group of people who should not get the Pfizer and BioNTech vaccine first. People who have had a medical history of anaphylactic or severe or immediate allergic reaction to any ingredient in the Pfizer and BioNTech vaccine should not take the vaccine. If these symptoms manifest after the first dose, the second dose must not be taken. This group of people can look into getting other types of COVID-19 vaccines. Anyone aged 18 and above and have no medical history of any of the symptoms mentioned before are recommended to get the COVID-19 vaccine. Herd immunity occurs when a significant amount of the population is immune to a certain disease. This makes the spread from person to person highly unlikely. Herd immunity also protects the people who are unable to get vaccinations due to medical conditions such as a diagnosis of autoimmune diseases. Unfortunately, there are some common side effects after getting the COVID-19 vaccine. Some of them include pain, redness and swelling on the arm that you got the shot on and overall for the entire body you may experience tiredness, nausea, chills and fever. Here are some results to the local and systematic reactions to two groups of people, the first one being people aged from 18 to 55 and the second group of people aged above 55. Now that we're all more aware of the Pfizer BioNTech vaccine, I hope that more people continue to do their educated research on vaccines overall. We should fight fear with the power of knowledge. Thank you.